Oh yeah, somebody just wrote, oh shit, we live. So we're oh, live. Yeah. All right. Sweetness. All right. All right, here yes. we are. What's Welcome. up, people? Do, do the theme song. Yeah. <laughs> all right all right nice. uh, we're just checking all the bells and whistles we got out here and uh yeah what yo what up somebody says to me isn't that the guy who dies in r7 does he die i don't is know guy, is that me oh man know. who is that this guy oh, it's this guy yeah it's him. that guy's r7 related what what's your name uh my name is kanda all right Yours, come, oh, come on in. We got our other guest. Right, we got yes. another one too. We got <laughs> on another in. one coming. It's so this is the the R and D one producer cast. That's right. That's it's right. A, it's a, like a tap takeover. That's right. Except it's with producers. That's right. We're taking over with producers here. So we got Kana oh, from yes. Resident Evil, and did it make Cry Five? That's right. Wait, what second? The make Cry Five. The <laughs> <laughs> make Cry Five, an excellent game. Let me tell you. But and then okay, so what's your name? Uh, my name is Michiteru. All right, Michiteru yep. Okabe. Okabe, yep. Senior producer. Yeah. Se- senior. Yeah. Senior producer senior. on DMC5. And That's before right. we get into the discussion here, we just wanted to say, again, thanks for listening. Um, it's always a pleasure to have you. We know that you've got a lot of options out there, and so we appreciate you taking the time to listen to us. Um, this is our first foray into live streaming, so hopefully it goes well. This will be Probably. a podcast for those who are not able to attend. Is attend the right word? The, uh, the attend podcast. view, yeah. About, but it, it's pretty cool because we get to actually speak with the fans, yeah. so to speak, Yeah. Um, because we're watching the live chat and we're talking. Some people are, wow, tuning in at 4 a.m. Oh, man. Dude, you guys are hard. You guys are awesome. Awesome. Seriously, thank you so much for thank you. Yeah. taking the awesome. time. And awesome, thanks. Shout out to Argentina. Um, and <laughs> Argentina, that's <laughs> yeah, awesome. They're, they're throwing some memes up there. Some of them are choice. All right. Uh, um, <laughs> greetings from Canada and Australia. Oh, awesome. Nice. This is actually that's super so cool. global. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Um, and uh, again, please subscribe to the podcast uh, wherever you get your podcasts, and sub- subscribe to this channel as well. Um, hopefully, we'll do more of these if this goes well. Uh, let us know what you think. Um, but yeah, again, a, a big, huge, heartfelt thanks from everyone on the team, yep. uh, especially in Division One, because that's where we are. And yep. uh, without further ado, let's uh, roll the music. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that's, uh, that's as high tech as we get here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, somebody from New York. Shout out to New York. Yes. That's which wh- part of which part of New York are you from, Pete? Me? Yeah. Well, I'm originally from New Jersey, but I was <laughs> living on uh, uh, the New Jersey <laughs> part of New York. Wait a minute. 89th oh, between first and second. That no san. You looked out with a. There he is, and there he goes, probably to the bathroom. Well, no, actually, he's got a meeting. He's got a meeting right now. Um, but yeah, that's the cool thing. So we were like, we're gonna do this. Let's do it on the Devil May Cry floor, and we have all yeah. kinds of. Everyone's people just that are staring at by. us now. So what we thought would be fun is it, I can see the new build over there. <laughs> yeah. Now you're just taunting You're such a tease. <laughs> I see the build. Well, we see the build every day. But. <laughs> That's true. We do see the build over there. Uh, but I thought it'd be great if we could kind of randomly bring in people from the Devil May Cry team just oh, to say hello real quick. Surprise. Let's, yeah. let's do it. Let's All right. Just do it, Matt. Go. Yeah. Invite <laughs> someone. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All the secrets are on the other side of the screen. Well, I guess. Um, although, actually, what's on the other side of the screen is a big storage box. Yeah. You guys are fantastic. Always look like you're having fun. Thanks. We, we try to look like we're having fun. Greetings from Osaka. Wow. Thank you. This building? Yeah. Maybe, maybe, maybe it's someone inside. The other building. Yeah. <laughs> Will we have a journal reading today? Good question. Do you guys want to hear some more of Maki's memoirs? That might make an appearance. We'll see. Depends on Maki. Mm. Um, just, just to preempt things, if you have questions that we can't answer, no unfortunately, come? we're... They're coming. They're coming. Okay. They're coming. All right. We got some All people right, coming in. We got a couple here. Tell oh, Matt to do the face. Nice. Oh, yeah. here we go. Yeah. Spoken about on the last yeah. podcast. Come on in, guys. Yeah. Nice. No more. We you got to get in camera. <laughs> get in camera. We, we talked about these see. guys, yeah, on the last podcast. And then, name and eto, eto, shokushi o onegashimasu. All right. Yeah. So there you go. Uh, this is uh, the guy we talked about last time. This is Mr. Kinoshita, and he's the art director on the project. Model lead, Nagaki. And here we got one of our 3D leads. He's the model lead for characters, and his name is Nagaki-san. That's Nagaki. Right. And Nagaki-san. that's right, he's the guy who's painstakingly looking at everything. That's right. That's Along right. with this guy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 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 
Yeah, man. Ah, uh, Kami no Kiko He does, and as I said, the longer the project goes, the curlier and larger it gets. That's right. No way. So he's the reference for Hugo in Street Fighter 3. Hugo is the button. Oh, wow. Because he actually, he, actually he actually drew the pixel art for Hugo in SF3. That's, That's awesome. Really cool. See, there you go. This is the kind of stuff that we've always wanted on the yeah. podcast. Yeah. This, kind of this is awesome. How do you say that? Five is a little bit of a leak. That's true. That's a good point. That's true. That's a good point. 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 That's a good So, yeah, I mean, Kimosan has been with the company a long time since the mid 90s, and he was just saying that he worked on, he did the character designs for、uh, Project Justice. What's Project, is Project Justice what we call it in, in, in the、um, States? I can't remember now. Wait, wait. The fans wait, will tell us, actually. Wait, wait. What? Wow, now I'm driving blank. You screwed up. That was good. Thank you. See, leave it to Kanasan. History of the company. Right, exactly. Mr. History of the company. His story is coming. Yep. And,、uh, and then you were saying, what else? <laughs> Rival schools and what? He designed one of my favorite characters. He designed Zenogre. <laughs> Zenogre. I love the music, I love the、yep. design in Monster Hunter. Yep, yep. Nagak san, do you like that? Dogma. Okay, Drag's Dogma. Worked on Drag's Dogma. Yep, yep. Deep is just like that. That's right. All right, we're, we're not going to talk about that. <laughs> All right, and on that note, move on to the next. <laughs> Moving on, right?、Uh, speaking, speaking, so, DMC5, you can't say, 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 you can't プレイヤーもモンスターも作ったので、そうそう、彼彼が作ったと。世界一の。世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。そう、世界一の。Again, we hope that you guys get a chance to take a look and enjoy what you find, you know? So, all right. Hey, Adios, Mas. Ciao. All right, so, thanks, guys.、Uh, so much, so much, so much, <laughs> Look forward to it. Sweet. All right, so there we go. And we'll have, we'll let Okabasan sit down again here. He's been standing up for a while. <laughs> Sweet. So, yeah.、Uh, That's the kind of stuff we're kind of hoping to do. Just kind of st- like random stuff like this. Off the cuff. We haven't planned、yeah. it very well, so apologies for that. But, all right, should we go ahead and move on? I think we should move into you know, what we usually do, which is tell a story、okay. uh, about one of our employees. Or、right. one of the, well, not our employees, we don't own Capcom, but、mm. one of the people that work here at Capcom. <laughs> and、uh, today we've, we've brought Serge Kanda, and、yes. he has been with the company. He's quite a veteran himself, actually. Yeah, How many years have you been here now? 16? 16. Wow. Yeah. Man, that's amazing. Jeez.、Yeah. And he's Capcom proper. He's one of the right, originals. Right, right. Um, um, again, um, unlike the three of us. Right. <laughs> <laughs> We're dirty outsiders. We came from. Is the word proper? Is actually, it's actually common? No, no, no. We just use that from yeah, okay. the Japanese. That's our. I hear a lot of proper, proper, proper. Yeah, that's what we use internally. Yeah, yeah. He's proper Capcom. Yeah. Unlike us dirty outsiders. Exactly. Exactly. Exactly.、Um, but yeah, we'll, we'll start at the beginning, actually. And、uh, apparently, I have a catchphrase now that I have to say, which、mm. is, What's your deal?、Uh, what's your deal? <laughs> It basically deal? means, so, yeah, yeah I, I know everyone gets confused. <laughs> It basically just means, Tell us a little bit about yourself. Where,、mm. where、okay. did you grow up? Where、yep. did you start? Yeah, yeah, let's start with, yeah. Where, did you, where were you born? Where did you grow up? I was born in the uh, uh, Shizuoka Prefecture,、okay. which is located uh, uh, between、um, Tokyo. And Kyoto.、Mm-hmm. Nice, okay. That's、uh, um, famous for tea, Japanese tea. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Mount Fuji, right? Yeah. Yeah. Mount yeah. Fuji, yes.、Yeah. But the, the place I was born is actually it's also famous for、uh, eel. Eel, mm-hmm. okay. Mm-hmm. Unagi. Unagi. Eel, okay.、Uh, right on. Which is quite a delicacy. Unagi pie. Unagi pie, yes. Ah, okay. So, Unagi pie is actually. So, yeah. So, 
Well, can you it's explain unagi pie? Because it's kind of unagi pie is a snack different yeah. for foreigners to snack yeah, for you know. night. But it's okay. So you eat it before bed. So uh, it has that kind of like you know the eels. Uh, how to say? Yeah, bits of eel in it, right? Eel means like you know for night. Meat. But it's sweet. So yes, 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 yes. Yeah. So I, I can actually buy it at a Shinjuku station. So you don't have to go home. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's really good souvenir for. Yeah. You know, yeah, that's true. Yeah, you buy it, give it as a gift. Yeah, People yeah. Pretty happy. So when, yeah, trips. when I lived in Tokyo, so actually, you know, I went uh, back home and then, you know I forgot to buy the unagi pie, but I could you know get it at Shinjuku. So you know it's really right it's popular. Right yeah. Yeah. It popular. Is it is it just <laughs> as good though if you buy it in Tokyo? Is it just as good as if you buy it in Shizuoka, or is it a little better in Shizuoka? <laughs> well. It's a little bit better than right. in Shizuoka. Right on. I hope. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's that's where I was born. Cool. And uh, grew up. Okay. Okay. So that's where you grew. So, so how did you go from there to Osaka? Uh, so actually, I went to a university uh, in Kyoto. Uh, so the, uh, that then means actually, he's smart. Yeah. Not not Kyoto University. Yeah. <laughs> one, one, one of the private uh, university in uh, in Kyoto. Okay. Then actually, I actually moved to Kansai, mm-hmm. and I uh, graduated from uh, the university, and I got a job at Capcom. So I, I, I'm a plopper, so I've been right. working for Capcom for since, since then. Actually, why did you choose Capcom? Yeah, there you go. Watch it. Um, I was uh, so when I, uh, I when I did that job hunting, uh, I um, I kind of I was interested in in introducing like Japanese culture or Japanese um, how to say anything uh, from, you know Japan originated stuff to like overseas yeah. so one of the, the you know my uh interest is actually gaming mm-hmm. so you know i uh, i chose the the game you know game companies uh, uh which uh makes kind of you know like age aged game you know like really good action game mm-hmm. so you know capcom is very mm-hmm. you know yep. my kind of top priority yeah that makes sense yeah. so, so we got a question that's actually going to be nice. my next question too uh did you know English before you got into university then? How do you end up speaking um, English? Yes, I actually, mm-hmm. I, I, I spent some time in, in Canada and the States before mm-hmm. I, I uh, went to a university. Okay. Mm-hmm. So I, were, I went to uh, uh, Florida first. Okay, oh. interesting. So I was sent, I was sent by my mom. Cause yeah. I, uh, she just said, get out? No, <laughs> <laughs> well, it's kind of, yeah. Okay. okay. So you, you learn. Okay, uh, nice. Uh, That's good. You learn, you know. That's great. Like, how, how to say, uh, dif- you know, different stuff. So it's kind of like old Japan, where you know they sent a lot of educated people out to the West to learn certain crafts or trade, and come back and bring that to Japan. Yeah. It's kind of in a way right. what they do. So and she, she's um, she's got a friend, you know, lived in Florida. So I, you know, she contacted her, and I was uh, uh, I was living uh, with them for uh, about a, uh, half a year. Mm-hmm. Then I came back to Japan, and I uh, went to Canada for about a year uh, to uh, take her. Uh, ESL. Oh, oh okay. Yeah. Right <laughs> English, yeah, English, second, second language. 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 Yeah. 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 Yes, yeah. yes. Right. Yeah. Okay. So that's right. that's basically where I learned uh, English. But you know, before that, mm-hmm. we basically you know, learned English no. from <laughs> junior high. Yeah, kind of. Yeah. Learn. Kind of like, you, know, you learn it like you learn math. You know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's like this plus this equals this. You yes. guys know. You know grammar better than most Americans. Yeah. 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 That's true. This <laughs> is pen. <laughs> pen. <laughs> Yeah. yeah. I don't know, but I mean, you know, I'm, I've met some people though, like some younger kids who, mm-hmm. like, all they've done is just gone to school for English and then they kind of practice it outside of school and their English is really yeah, good. Yeah, I think it's changed quite a bit since yeah. since mm-hmm. back in our day, Matt. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. We're old people now. So. <laughs> right. Yeah. Okay. Right on. Oh, sorry, sorry. So, which part of the Canada you? Oh, I was in uh, uh, BC, uh, but oh. the, uh, not, not Vancouver. Okay. Uh, the city named uh, Kamloops. It's actually uh, five hours oh. north from Vancouver. Okay, five hours Kokoha north. Okay. Highway, so it's interesting. Nice. Yeah, it's a uh, how to say it, like it's a mountain side. Mm. Right, right. Yeah, so it's it's not a big city. Mm. Yeah, Okabasan was also in Canada. Actually. Yeah, right, yeah, right. Yeah. But at different times, I yeah, imagine. Yeah. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> right. Okay. And, you, and you were in Toronto, right? Yeah, yeah Toronto, Toronto and Saint Catherine mm. and. Vancouver a little bit, yeah. Oh, cool. Yeah. Okay, that's pretty cool. Well, nice. You already knew Vancouver a little bit before we did Raccoon City then. Yeah. Right now. That's cool. All right. Yeah. So what was your major in, in university then? Economics. Economics. Yes. Ah, okay. So that's why you're good with numbers. 
Yeah. <laughs> That's right. So I would make him make all the PR plans, right? That's right. <laughs> numbers. Wait, what? Right. With there, numbers. There are numbers on the pages. That sometimes. <laughs> right on. Oh, yeah. Excel doesn't always do that. Right. But uh, interesting. Okay, so you went to study economics. And then while you're in school, you thought, okay, I'm definitely going to work in games. Um, Was that like a long-term goal or were you just like, I'm doing, no, you know, because in Japan see. you have, what is it, your junior year, you start looking for jobs, right? Everyone starts looking for jobs right. around their junior year of college and there's a number of jobs, like different places you could go work. Why did you settle on games? Yeah. That's, uh, that's basically it's fun. That's, <laughs> that's, that's, <laughs> good, good, good yeah. answer. That's cool. <laughs> I just want to do what I want to do, right? So right. it's, yeah. yeah. I, Life with the show. Yes, That's right. Yeah. My, oh, my, right expect- totally. my expectation is like, oh, okay, okay. So working for game gaming company is like, oh, okay, so, you know, we can actually play a game, you know, every day. Right okay. on. So just, you know, in, in general, it it's probably fun. Mm, good. Was it as fun as you thought it would be? <laughs> <laughs> also, did you, get to question. Play? <laughs> did you get to play games every day? Is that something that you do every day? I, I'm trying, right I have to, you know, like uh, play, you know, the builds, games, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Right I just, have to spend my time, like, you know, on different stuff. So as you guys know, yep. Yep. it's a lot of, you know, <laughs> a lot of connecting dots oh, yeah. that don't always connect. Yep. Right. But, uh, <laughs> but it's, it's fun working for Capcom. Yes. We got, yeah. we got good people here, right? We do. Like, yes. Yeah. That's, you know, yeah. Yeah. right. Like, uh, and that's, that's part of the reason that, you know, I love to bring people in from the yes. floor and stuff. Bunch you know, of people, order, talented right? people. And yeah. that's why we wanted to do this podcast, actually show the people outside right. what it's like to work here. Because I think a lot of times, you know, not even just Japanese companies, but a lot of times they don't get to see behind the mm. curtain, right? Mm. And obviously we can't say certain things because of PR limitations or marketing limitations, but whatever we can, we definitely want to share with everyone out yep. there, right? Yep. And also, as I told you, so, you know, uh, I thought like a game, gaming is actually, you know, we can actually appeal to, you know, outside of Japan, but, you know, globally. So right. that's, that's one of the that's main awesome. reasons that I chose uh, Capcom. So when that's you weird. first started here, um, mm. Or actually, first of all, how did you get the job? Did you just walk in one day and you're like, oh, I want to work here? <laughs> um, so it's different from the the states or other countries, mm-hmm. I, I think. But there's, uh, you know, like for, and when we were in the, uh, the fourth, you know, fourth year of university. Well, actually, it's, it's not like it's the third year, fourth, right? The third year yeah. and the fourth year. So we... Look at the you know, like job opportunity, and we go to uh, check you know the the company's uh, uh, how to say like the profile or mm-hmm. you know like, uh, so you know via uh, internet or you know like actual uh, how to say like orientation right. this kind of stuff. Right. So then uh, um, so then after that we apply for the company mm-hmm. via like you know application form. Yep. Sending a resume. Right. And then uh, I did some interviews. Right. Twice, three times. Here. Here, yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. And then, uh, yeah, I actually passed. But you have an interesting background because right now you're a producer and you work in dev, but originally, where did you work? Actually, my first year is I uh, worked uh, at the uh, uh, OP business department, which is like operation, I think. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Operations. Yeah. Operation. Yeah. Uh, runs uh, Plaza Capcom. Plaza Capcom. Oh, Plaza Capcom. Yes. Yes. Gasing, uh, gasing. The, arc- the arcades. Yeah, the arcades. 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 Yeah. arcades. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Capcom has a couple of mm-hmm. company-owned arcades yes. in Japan, right? Yep. Yeah. We That's still have them, right? my first job. First right. year. That's yes. right. That's yeah. right. Now, but that wasn't just you, right? Like, I thought that was kind of part of the, the training, is that almost uh, yes, all the... Yes, about 10 people uh, uh, who got a job on um, business side. Mm. Uh, that's kind of, you know, their first year, you know, as a kind of trainee right. Uh, right. to learn, you know, their arcade uh, business. Right, mm-hmm. right, right, right. Okay, yeah, because, yeah, and Yoko did that too, right? Yes, yeah, yeah, but so, nobody right. knows who Yoko is. So <laughs> Yoko, I want to explain that. Yoko, is, uh, Yoko used to work in our group in global production. Yeah. And, and the, we had a couple podcasts ago where we actually had the whole group on, right? She used to work in that group, now she's at CUSA. And yeah, I just remember, yeah, she did that same thing that you did where she trained. Uh, yeah. Actually, it was pretty common practice back then. Right. right. Um, you start, and I think a lot of Japanese companies would have the idea that in order to understand the business, you had to work in different facets of it. So yeah. you might work a few days in QA, you might look at what the yeah, artists yeah. do, you might look at uh, you know the business side. 
side of stuff, marketing, yeah. whatever. And then you kind of settle into your division and grow from there. Yeah, so current, uh, current uh, uh, role, you know, no, the, the job yeah. I'm, I'm doing is actually the seventh. The seventh job. Jobs. Oh, meaning okay. within the company. So seven the company. actual oh. different jobs. Right. Oh. Meaning like you went from marketing to. So yeah. I, yes, after the op operation uh, business, then I moved to uh, uh, sales. Sales. Oh, okay. yes. Actually, we sold, uh, I sold uh, 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 some of the, the Mega Man oh. you know, X games. Oh, nice. Cool. Yeah, Beautiful Joe. Wow. Oh, nice. Nice. Oh, cool cool game. Joe. I love that game. RE4, nice, man. Nice, yeah. nice. Did you get like a nice bonus from RE4 or something? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That'd be great. <laughs> fair enough, fair enough. Then after that, I uh, went to the you know, a different uh, department uh, um, in charge of uh, product uh, management, which is a kind of sales mm -hmm. strategy cool. for a domestic right. market. Mm -hmm. right. Okay, oh, domestic. focusing on okay. the domestic. Okay. Right. So uh, I worked on the... Uh, uh, Mega Man Battle Network. Nice. So we actually okay. co collaborated with the uh, Koro Koro Comic. Okay. Oh. So it kind of, you know, uh, did a um, lot of a collaboration. Mm -hmm. Nice. So yeah. Koro Koro Comics, that's like one of the big, like, comic, yep. like, you know, what do you call it? They, they have, like, big comic books yes. that they sell in yes. Japan, right? Yeah. Is that, it's no, big, right? Right, yeah, really big, right? And, like, <laughs> like volumes? I don't know what volume, Yeah, them. right? And it's, like, every week it comes out, right? And there's, like... Every oh, month. Every, every month? month? Oh, okay. Out. And it's just, there's just all kinds of comics in there, right? Yeah, yeah. So you guys had a Mega Man Battle Network comic mm. in that. Mm. And what did you do on that comic, then? Comic? I didn't, you know, I didn't work on comic, actually. I, I worked on the, uh, kind of, you know... Um, the sales strategy, like putting like you know, all the uh, opportunities together mm -hmm. and uh, present it to the uh, like retailers. Right on. Cool. So this is you know it's kind of like a you know uh, the PR and marketing you know plan and you know uh, pleasances at you know the uh, major events. Yep. So. Sorry to interrupt, but <laughs> apparently right. the, the, the people want to know. There's a question. Mm -hmm. They want to know what everyone's game they're playing or what they like to what we like to play in oh. our off time. Oh, nice. Oh, off time. Yeah, and you, they know that you like Tetris Effect. Uh, yeah, it did. Yeah, I'm looking forward to that. I, uh, yeah. Obviously, that's not out yet, right? I no. really want to play that. No. I haven't. I'm not like a huge puzzle guy per se, but like I've been playing the hack out of Luminous over the last couple weeks. Mm -hmm. And yeah, I'm really looking forward to Tetris Effect. Like those are two great games that like, you know, I figure I can get on my Switch and just like play it anywhere. And right. like I'll, that's one like I'll always play, right? So yeah, I've been playing those a lot lately. How about you guys? Have you been playing anything at home? Or anything you're looking forward to? Yeah. Um, looking forward to uh, playing a Spider-Man with my son. Ah, nice. Nice. Uh, nice yeah. Actually, I ordered the, the limited edition. Nice. Did you? PlayStation cool. Floor and Spider-Man. Yes, oh, yes. No oh, way. So you're, are you a big Spider-Man Spider fan? My son. <laughs> okay. And wait, you got an extra PS4? Or did you not have a PS4 at home before? PS4, but you know, I'm buying a PS4 Pro, so. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah, nice. Yeah, he's upgrading. He's upgrading. Nice. He's nice. upgrading. Mm. Yeah. How about yourself, mm, I forgot the name, but... <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> There's a lot of them. The new one. You know, oh, the yeah, new the new game. one. Yeah. Yeah. New that game. one's good. I like it. It's new. <laughs> new one. Yeah. Anything. Yeah. Anything new. Yeah. Cool. Run out, run out trying to keep up on stuff. Yeah. That makes sense. Yeah. I mean, at, at this stage, I've been playing a lot of Monster Hunter. Love yeah. Monster Hunter World. Yeah. Um, but also, I just got a Hollow Knight for the Switch, which is really cool. Oh, you started oh, playing that? Yeah, yeah, it's really yeah. good. Sweet. I, I love Metroidvania Sweet. type, mm. type, mm. type mm. style games. Um, and then, of course, I'm looking forward to Red Dead. All right, oh, yeah, nice, yeah, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. October is going to be And Spider-Man. So um, my wallet's going to When does Spider-Man come out? September, uh, right? September, September. All right. September. All right. Nice. Oh, man. September 7th. That's just a little while yes. way away here, man. That's awesome. Nice. Side note, we used to play a lot of Monster Hunter internally, right? We oh, used yeah. to get a bunch of people together and play a bunch of Mo Monster Hunter. So it's a lot of fun. It's good. Yeah, yeah. Not not our division, but we still support Capcom. Capcom <laughs> One Capcom, which is it's a pretty awesome game. Yeah, man. It's one of my favorites, actually. Yeah, man. So all right, so you Back worked on you. the quote unquote comic thing in the operations <laughs> in the operations division, <laughs> and then what happened after that? After that, yeah. So I uh, I was in charge of like uh, um, promoting the uh, uh, yoga. Ah, the Western, Western games, games. Western the Western games. which yeah. had bad connotations back, right, in the back day, then. Right? Mm. Yoga used to mean like yeah. not good. Yeah. <laughs> At that time, but, actually, uh, the Capcom uh, uh, started you know distributing uh, uh, Grand Theft Auto. Yep. Uh, yep. Uh, yep. Uh, oh, so you worked on like that? And got a war, uh, right? Kind of, yeah. yeah but you know, there's uh, lots of like, other you mm -hmm. know, like um, I, I shouldn't say you know like 
not my, you know, it's minor, but you know, are they like mm. small, you know? Yeah, no, it's games. great. I mean, because w- w- there was a lot of good games that were actually out there, and we wanted to show the domestic market that there's some good, mm. there were good Western games out there, right? Mm. Mm. We have a question from the fans: Is Akuma in the RE2 remake? Kanasan, any comment? <laughs> <laughs> or Pete, either of you guys. Do you either, can you guys comment on RE2 Remake? We can neither confirm nor no, no, no. deny such rumors. Fair enough. <laughs> Is that the right statement? Fair enough, fair enough. All right. All right, sorry to interrupt you. Keep going. Uh, yeah. So that's uh, you know, what I did uh, uh, in the kind of product management team uh, in uh, uh, Capcom Japan. Cool. And then uh, marketing and international business. And mm. after that, I went to uh, uh, Capcom USA. Okay. Mm. Okay. Well, that that was, was big. And for reference, what year was this that you moved to CUSA? 2008. 2008. The okay. year I started. All right. I, I knew him I for like two months, and then he and then he left. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Right. But you guys had already met each other when you had just got into Capcom, and you were just yeah. about to leave. Yeah, we had met yeah. because there were some yes. connections. Yes. And, yes. and then he went over to CSA. Right. And we'd meet periodically when he came out, out to Japan. Yeah, man. Okay, cool. He cool. used to have a shaved head then. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah actually. Yeah. If we could show his shine shirt, oh, yeah. his ID card, and like just show the picture part. <laughs> yeah. So you had. I, I love looking at. We all have these IDs, and mine is in my mine is in my, uh, my phone. Your wallet. Sorry, guys. I'm going to move. In your phone? Oh. But yeah, my phone case. Right? So okay. that's not the camera, Matt. <laughs> Mine is really old now. So well, and I, Matt, don't show it. They're gonna they're gonna replicate it and then. Oh, <laughs> yeah. oh man. Well, hopefully nobody will do anything mean to me. I can only hope. But yeah, so uh, basically, we never update these things, right? So like, yeah, you have one from like 16 years ago, still, don't you? No, actually, so there's one update. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. Yeah, since then. Oh, they give you they give an update. What is it, like every ten years or something? Like, I don't know. I don't remember. Okay, fair enough. Yeah, but you still have yours for when you yes, got yeah, in, yeah, right? Yeah, and that's yeah. the eleven years. Yeah, ago, mine right? actually said so the original one has the uh, rival school, but the the you know Aww. current one has the Street Fighter. Yeah, yeah. So. Okay. Ooh, Aww. ooh, rival schools. I would like <laughs> rival schools one man. Get some Itsuno love in there. <laughs> yeah, that would be good. <clears throat> okay, so you went to CUSA and like what what was the plan? What were you going to do at CUSA? Ah. Uh, I did actually uh, like marketing and yeah. also like PR stuff. Uh, you know, basically like a bridge between the uh, Japan and the uh, US. Yeah. So uh, that was like my main uh, role, and I w- worked on the, you know Street Fighter and Resident Evil right on. mainly. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Right. On. Okay. Right. On. Uh, yeah. I mean, those are pr- those are definitely the two like biggest franchises I think at, at CUSA. Right. Mm. They love they love Street Fighter. They love RE. Good franchises. Not as cool as Devil May Cry, but you know, that's okay. That's yeah, okay. at that time, our, our company is actually uh, trying to kind of uh, uh, expand, uh, you know, uh, the uh, overseas branches. Right. You know, right. like Salesforce, mm-hmm. marketing force. Yeah. Uh, so it was, yeah, uh, it was good uh, experience. Mm. After that, I did a licensing business for, uh, for about two years, and then uh, I moved to uh, like strategic planning. It's more like, you know, uh, the um, project like kick off mm. and you know get approval is to like you know move uh, on the, like development stuff. Right. Right. So more like you know kind of internal you know um, uh, like coordination and also yeah. uh, the working with the dev, uh, Capcom Vancouver. Yep. Uh, yep. Stuff. Yeah, you know. that makes sense. And yeah, like getting getting everybody together to decide okay, what games should we make? Kind of you know how how should we approach that right. and that kind of, of stuff, right? Portfolio, right? Portfolio, mm-hmm. Portfolio. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 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 portfolio then I back, management. Back to Japan and then you know got a job. So <laughs> got a job. Got a job. Did, <laughs> got a did, job. Uh, <laughs> uh, been doing uh, 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 production uh, here. Production, yes. Yeah. Yeah. But so, I mean, I think you already had some experience in the West by the time you had moved to Capcom USA. But <clears throat> was there? Was was there any difficulty for you and you moved to the States and like, okay, it's kind of a different lifestyle from Japan or were you already adjusted to it? Like, no problem when you moved over to the States. It was easy for me, but that was uh, difficult for my family, especially okay. my mm-hmm. wife. That makes sense. She okay. had a hard time to mm-hmm. adjust herself okay. Okay. You know, to her life in, in the States. Did you meet your wife? Did you meet your wife at Capcom? Did you meet her at, in college? Uh, after college. After no, college. no, no. Before college, actually. Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah. Cool. Okay. And you guys have just been together for that long yes, then? Yes, yes. Uh, and but she didn't have the kind of experience like no. living overseas that you did. Yep. So that makes sense. That would have been a little rougher for her. I reckon. Mm-hmm. That makes sense. Mm-hmm. And then you guys had kids in the states, right? 
Uh, oh, two here, two, 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 two okay. here, and one in, in the states. Okay. Oh, okay. So, what, what was that like for them then? Going like for to be so Man, young. The fans are going to get upset. You're you're not showing. You're obscuring oh, the view. Obscuring, I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> I'm, I'm obscuring the the control layout. Is that what it is? Is the control layout? What yeah. are you saying here? No, it's the. Not bra. It's the demi fiend. <laughs> right. Anyway, <All> right. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Okay, but yeah. Uh, yeah, kids, for like for yeah kids, for the kids, what kids was it? Easy, they they yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. nice. They cool. um yeah, they, they had a adjust, right? yeah mm-hmm. they had a lot of fun you know and stays you know at Daddy, school probably uh, good wide open spaces yes. can run yes. around mm-hmm. that's pretty cool yeah I, I live in a foster city this is you know family friendly mm-hmm. uh, you know, city good place. that's cool. lots of parks. That's cool. Yeah. Oh, nice, so nice. Outdoor like activity. You know, I mean, that's the thing. I mean, living in Osaka, especially, we have a ton of parks here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Like, I can, I can walk to like four or five different parks. Yeah. By the yeah, way, Matt did not this. confirm anything. I don't know what people are writing. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I've confirmed something. <laughs> I don't I've, know. I've, I've confirmed the control continue. layout. I've confirmed, <laughs> confirmed that. I can tell you that. Uh, yeah. So, whereas. I feel like in the states you don't you you don't have like as many parks within walking distance. So I do mm. like that about Osaka a lot. But that is so nice. where you lived, you had a lot of nice parks that you could go to, and you guys could enjoy you know playing in the park and stuff, huh? In in the states? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Nice. New York actually, major cities have really nice parks. Mm. They, they might be far, but like New York has a number of different parks. Of course, there's Central like Park. Central around. Park, exactly. But then you also have smaller parks. We even have water that shoots out, and you can run around. Kids, mm. like, my right. daughter loved it. Right, 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 right. Well, we got we got the water at uh, Osaka Castle. We do. Yeah, man. With the water. the water shoots out, yeah. We got that stuff. It's over. That's not at the park. That's at the fountain. Yeah, well, you know. <laughs> 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 but there's, there's like a little spot where like kids can play and like they do have water. Like uh, there's like a little Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure, you sure. Know? All right, I'm not making any sense. All right, well. <laughs> Cool. So well, just how, like a regular day. How did, how, well, how did the discussion come then that it was, okay, I've been in the States for this many years and now I'm going to come back to Japan and be a producer? Like, how did that go? How did it go? Yeah. Um, I actually uh, said, there was actually a cap you know, uh, on my visa, mm. like working, working visa okay. in the States. So I, you know, I kind of you know, had to uh, find, you know, the place here in Capcom, Japan. So I'm kind of like, you know, um, talking to like, uh, the, some of the, the key uh, 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 staff in at Capcom, so I'm actually you know, coming back. So then, uh, uh, you know, Takeuchi says actually, you know, so, uh, he um, um, uh, gave Who's me the offer. Who's Takeuchi son? Yeah, who is Takeuchi uh, son? Oh, uh, Jun Takeuchi. Yeah, who's <laughs> Takeuchi? Jun Takeuchi. <laughs> so head of, you know, the. Uh, our uh, boss, the, uh, yeah, department, okay. yes, uh, uh, Deb One, executive producer, Deb One, yeah, yeah. Uh, Ari Seven, yep, executive at Capcom, exactly, yeah, yeah, just a straight up executive, <laughs> yep, that's true, right, that's true. He uh, and he was he was the producer on like Lost Planet Two, Lost, right. Lost yep. Planet, that's yeah. right, Lost stuff, Planet Ari Five, Ari Five, yeah. mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. but okay, so he's like, yeah, I want you, I want you in Japan, and you're like, all right, Uncle Sam, that's right, like Uncle <laughs> Sam, I want you. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> like that. Cool. That's, okay. that's basically, you know, yeah, how I actually I, I got this opportunity. Right on. That's really cool, man. Now, before we get to the, the next part, yeah? before we get to the other part, I think it's time, I think it's time once again oh, to, we're gonna call? to call in somebody. Call somebody? Oh, sure. Cry All right. I don't so know. you just scream like, Devil May Cry! Oh, wait, that's right. Every time we scream Devil May Cry, you have to go get some. If we do that, I'm going to be up a lot. But <laughs> yeah, okay. I'm Devil May Cry! Cry! I'm going to go find somebody. <laughs> <laughs> Now we have to do no. something for Resident Evil, I guess. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right. Mm. But yeah, uh, so is that when you when you came back, is that when you first started working on RE7 then? Is that, yes. Is that your first title back? Yes. Okay. And you were a producer on that as well. Mm-hmm. What was that experience like? Because it was a pretty new take on things, right? The way we approached it, development. I mean, we I gave the the talk with Nagi San at, at GDC and it was kind of like the next in the series like right. as it changes or mm-hmm. it adapts to, you know, the progression from the fixed camera and then to the the next in the series which is more uh over the shoulder mm-hmm. and, three, and now then we had 7 which was first person. So right. what was that like? Yes. Um, right. ah. <laughs> oh, well I, I guess um, we'll, we'll we'll hold on for that answer. Okay. Come on in. Oh, all right. This person is nervous. Yoshi-san. Yoshi-san. Have a seat, have a seat. 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 Have a seat
You might have seen him on our Twitter, actually. That's right. Ah, yeah. 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 ね、本当にすごくなってるボスのそれは本当にね吉井さんのおかげですよねどこまで話していいかわかりませありがとうございます詳細は全部話しちゃダメです<笑>何もできませんありがとうございます本当ね,ね,そうですねもうお盆もなく日々頑張ってます<笑>そうですね Yeah we have a, we have this、uh, in Japan in summer vacation in in Japan that we call お盆 the お盆 holidays and yeah He's just worked straight through them because he wants to make sure that these boss fights are going to be amazing. So, yeah. Yeah. Yep. And, he, and he's and he's actually from a place called He's actually from a place called Saitama, which is right next to Tokyo. And so, yes, his family went back to Saitama to, to enjoy being with the extended family while he's here. Working, working on making the,、right. the enemies and the bosses awesome. Yep,、mm-hmm. that's right. Yeah, so, this guy, didn't work, this guy didn't take any time off. That's right. So, you guys can hopefully be happy. Yeah, hopefully. <laughs> well, he really hopes. だからまあそのに頑張,頑張ったっていうのは本当にユーザーのためですよね。もちろん。ぜひユーザーに楽しんでいただきたいと思ってます。はい、で、あの一応コメントして、まあ、やっぱ敵とかボスは一番面白いと思ありがとうございます。面白いところだと思ってるんで。はい、ありがとうございます。ありがとう、吉田先輩だって。ナイス。ナイス。Thanks, 吉田さん。え、本当にうん。つい前ですかもういつでも一緒に飲みましょうよ。そう言って、anytime you're around, let's go drinking. いかもさ、we'll go drinking, it'll be good. もう今晩裏ナンバーで待ってますよ。We'll be waiting, we'll be waiting, nice. あの僕になんかカップで担当したゲーム。えっとモンスターハンタークロスダブルクロスとか戦国バサラ。なるほどね。えクロスでねやったんですか。クロスプレイヤーですね。プレイヤーも終わりですね。えなんかあの。えー、攻撃とか、あ、狩り技とか、狩り技とかですね。そうですね。そうですね。えー、なるほどね。ボーガンとか、なるほどね。そう、遠距離、遠距離武器、遠距離武器やってました。そう、he worked、uh, uh, he worked on a couple games before this and kind of recently he's worked on Monster Hunter Generations.、Uh, I know we just had Monster Hunter Generations Ultimate coming out on the Switch here,、uh, and so he worked on the player stuff. There, he worked on the long range weapons in particular, and、uh, the I'm sorry, I don't remember what we call call basically the super combos in generations. I can't think of that right now, but yeah, he like created those for instance as well. Not as nice, it was not. なるほどですね。まあじゃあ,あの最後のじゃあ,あのファン向けの一言を言いたくないでしょうか。あ、uh,、wait、I asked him a question.、Oh, okay, They want to know what his favorite boss from the series was. From D- from, from DMC. Monster, from DMC. 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 Ah, okay, good question.、Uh, nice. 一番個人的に一番好きなのは DMC4 のクレル。クレル。クレル from DMC4、mm-hmm.。There you go. That's his favorite.、Mm-hmm. Nice. nice. Right on. いいと思います。Right on. ファイブでね、何が一番好きか聞きたいけど、やっぱりでダメです。<笑><笑>本当にもう。<笑>もう<笑>もう<笑>首でしょうよ。<笑><笑> I'm like, yeah, it'd be great if you could talk a little bit about the bosses from this game. He says, yeah, well, you'd be fired, so no. So yeah, yeah. fair enough, fair enough. So it's a job, it's a job, it's a job. You can ask them that question later. That's right, yeah.、We'll、After the game releases. So it's a job, it's a job. I'm like, yeah, it's a job, it's a job. I'm like, yeah, it's a job, it's a job. ぜひですえ最後じゃあ,じゃあそうですね一言で、はい、終わりにしましょうか、えー、じゃあ頑張って、えー、もう全身全力で、えー、頑張ってデザインしますのでお楽しみにしてください All right. He says look、uh, we are doing everything we can to make the, the, the most enjoyable to design the most enjoyable game we possibly can so we hope you guys get a chance to check it out and we hope you, you like what we made cool All right, thank you. Thank you. s h i g o t o n i m o t o r i m a s And he's going back to work. All right, I'm sorry, I clearly interrupted something. No, he was just about to tell us about what it was like working on RE7. Nice, great, perfect,、uh, perfect. That was a challenge, you know, a big challenge. Yeah. yeah. So the project needs, uh, um, yeah. uh, how to say, a lot of like,、uh, input. Uh, Not just you know,、uh, internally, but also you know,、uh, externally. So、mm-hmm. we have to、uh, work with the、uh, you know,、uh, ex- external partners. Yep, I was also, very much involved with that. You know, <laughs> this, this one. You know. The VR.、Mm-hmm. VSVR, yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. That was、uh, you know, a lot of work. Yeah. Oh, I bet. 
I bet. Yeah, I mean, you know, so I many remember. parts. <laughs> it was. It, it's talking about the VR is interesting. I think because I remember when we were making that, I was like, okay, we're going to do VR. Nakanishi son wanted to do VR, you know, for a long time. From the, right? from the beginning. From the yeah. beginning, you know. And I just remember when we were first working on it. And it was like, oh, God, like, everyone's going to get motion sickness. What are we going to do? But those guys, they tuned and they tuned and they yeah. tuned, right? I mean, it's amazing. It's it's amazing to me that they managed, they put in all this work. And then the end result is that it really is still the kind of the representative game for PSVR, you know? The mm -hmm. game that when people want to play yep. PSVR, mm -hmm. that's kind of the first thing they yep. go to. So, I mean... I think that's really cool, and I'm really thankful that yeah. people have found that to be an enjoyable experience. You know, it's it's my understanding that we took a lot of the know-how we learned from uh, some of the 3D versions of games we put on the PC, like RE5, for mm -hmm. example. Like the guys were able to kind of extrapolate and use some of that technology to kind of throw it into VR and whatnot, mm -hmm. and use some of the technologies there. If I'm correct in my understanding, at least that's what some people have told me. So yeah. it's pretty interesting. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. And I mean, RE7 too. It must have been such a challenge because it was. It was like, all right, look, we're going to change the direction of the series, right? We've had, up until now, we've had three games in the original format. We had three games in the RE4 format. Now we're going to do something new, right? Right. So it, it must have been, like, I didn't work a whole lot on 7. I did, like, just a little bit of helping out at the beginning with some uh, of the scanning stuff and whatnot, right? But... I oh mean, yeah, way early yeah, on. Yeah, way early. Way like, early. Way that was we were doing testing, right? That's Basically, right. just doing some uh, R and D. Right, and that was it for me. I didn't really work on R seven yeah. other than that, you know. So, it, I I think he also named the new system like a. <laughs> I forgot the name. But, yeah. Isolated view. Oh, isolated. View. Isolated view. Okay. Isolated view. So yeah, you know, it's more like you know, kind of you know, promotion like you know, right, right, right. Well, and also. You're also you're also the guy that came up with we do it right. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. We do it, baby. Yeah, he, yeah. he doesn't get the credit. He should get the credit. I know you should get the credit. That's right. <laughs> He'd buy a son. You know, he works his butt off on all this stuff upstairs. But we do it is kind of. Copy right. That's right. <laughs> right. Kinda. That's we right. We even got shirts. We should have <laughs> right. worn them. That's right. That's right. That's true. Oh, oh, like oh, look who it is. All right. Oh, man. What's this guy? Go. Yes, please. Here we go. This is for Devil May Cry. This is the main event right here. Yeah. Here we go. Oh, he's, right. he's fixing himself up. Well, let's get him some makeup. Uh, Matt, makeup. Makeup, where are you? Hold on. Uh, well, come on, let's do this. Cool. Cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, I was like, oh, wow, we're actually on camera here. Look at this. Yeah. Man, yeah, that's right. The director of Devil May Cry 5. Oh, the on. shepherd of the Devil May Cry God, series. An all-around amazing game designer and director mm -hmm. of Capcom, Hideaki Itsuno. <laughs> oh, look, look at this. Everyone is screaming. Yes, oh, it's it's Itsuno, no. the beast guy himself. <laughs> Yes! The big boss, the legend, <laughs> savior. Bird shirt. Bird shirt! Yeah, I'm going to give you a lot he, he was, uh, he's been in a meeting. I was talking to him right before the meeting. I'm like, yeah, it'd be great to have you come on. And he's like, well, I got a meeting during that time. Yeah. And so we're like, that's fine. Look, we'll, we'll, we'll hold off as long as we can, you know, and whenever you get out of the meeting, come and talk to us. So here, here we got him right here. いや、約束してないもんもうみんな捨ててると思いますけど。なんかあの、なんでしょう。なんかファニーの一言とか。あ、えっと。あ、どこまで何を言っちゃダメなんですかね。So the the recurring theme here is, you know, I've been asking everybody, "Hey, can you give the fans a comment, you know, just something?" And it's like, "Well, all right, I don't know what I can actually talk about because yes, we don't want to ruin things for the PR and marketing people." So, we love them. They're good people. And we also like our jobs. Yeah, exactly. We also want to be fired. So. ずっと毎日やっててあれが強いんだあれがあのあの攻撃が強すぎ弱すぎるとかっていう話を毎日やってますねそう、explaining <笑> Balancing the bosses and the enemies uh, difficulty in the the most difficult mode. I think we're very specifically not saying what the most difficult mm. mode is on purpose. <laughs> so the most difficult mode. So did those guys have to tell us it's most difficult. Can you hold it again? It's like, I'm going to go to the next day. 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 Not, I'm not even asking. I thought you could scan a mission to the boss to go 
That was the day. Hi. So his homework here before we're leaving for Gamescom uh, for Germany on Sunday here, and he says so he's still got a couple. He can't. We can't say how many, obviously, but he's still got a couple bosses left that he needs to play against, finish, uh, and then also give everybody notes on. Okay, these are the final notes on just what we need to do with these boss characters. So <laughs> he's he's working hard, man. He's working <laughs> hard. So you that. Yeah. So what is your favorite pizza? Tikkaride mas kero. There you go. So a cheese, cheese and honey pizza. Uh, in Japan, you can get pizza with honey on it. And so, yeah, that's, that's his favorite. So we're hoping to actually enjoy some of that soon. I guess I can't reveal details on that yet. But, yes, we'll be enjoying pizza sometime in the near future. <laughs> <laughs> I, I like pizza. I had yeah, pizza on, good, on Wednesday. Yeah, but you, yeah. you know real pizza. You're from I New do. York. I not do. Gonna talk. We're, we can talk about that forever. Okay. Cheese and honey is pretty good. Cheese and honey. Mm-hmm. Do we have any? Do we have Oh, nice. Excellent Whoa. question. Who's his favorite boss? Excellent question, guys. Amazing. He says He says Kredo. He says Kredo. He says Kredo. ボスも好きだし勝てないボスも好きだしねそうですよねいやいやフォーインアビスリーユノーヒンクスプロヴェルジョーズアメイジングボスフロムディエムシーツリーアズウェルアンバリーズタカンバウトハウスディエムシーツ
uh, yesterday somebody tweeted at me. They're like, Matt, look at Gamescom. They've already announced all the all the different nominees for best of Gamescom stuff, and DMC Five's not in there. And mm-hmm. honestly, I like they were like, well, could it be that maybe just you guys didn't submit the game? And honestly, I don't know. I'm sorry. I should know this stuff, but I don't. So either way, I think whether we submit it or not, it's it, it's a great indicator that. Gamescom is going to have a bunch of amazing games, you know, whether it's what we're talking about Capcom or we're talking about any other company, right? Mm-hmm. So I can't wait. You know, this will be my first Gamescom. You've been there before, right? Yes. Have you been to Gamescom before? Nope. So, you know, he and I, we're going to be there for the first time. We're going to get a chance to see Cologne. We call it Cologne in English, right? Cologne. Is that how you say it? Yep, okay. Cologne. Mm-hmm. Right. Kidum. Well, Japanese. yeah, Japanese. I'm not German, but I think it's closer to that mm-hmm. in German. Sweet, yeah. So, I mean... <laughs> For DMC as well, obviously, you know, we have announced that it's going to be playable there for the yep. first time. Yep. So that's exciting. Yes. That's right. First playable for DMC 5 yes. in Germany. Matt, you have a fan. Somebody loves your voice and somebody's telling me to stop staring. I guess oh, I'm well, looking at this at the screen <laughs> too much or something. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> really well. because Pete's, Pete's I'm trying to look at the tabs. comments, but... Pete's actually sorry. keeping tabs on the, on the chat, so... Yeah, sorry, sorry. It's not, Matt, you're it's, also very handsome. Oh, you guys are super yeah. nice. Thank you. Matto-san. You guys are super nice. Matto, I appreciate it. Look at this. Now I'm going to say anything I can to make you uh, embarrassed. Uh, uh, Matt, I, say I, DMC is back. DMC is back! Yes! <laughs> I'm excited. Uh, yeah, okay, so we got that out of the way. And don't ruin your What's eyes. That? Oh, someone's worried about my eyes. Thank you. Uh, Thank you. That's, yeah, it's actually, it's, yeah, thanks. It's really yeah. nice. There's, this is a pretty nice screen. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we got some nice people in the chat, too. I know. So yeah. This is very nice. It. That's what we want, positivity, right? Yep. Uh, yes, very much mm-hmm. so. Yes, very much so. Uh, yeah, but yeah, we're going to have, again, we're going to have first playable for DMC5 yes. at Gamescom. Super excited about that. We're going to yep. do a bunch of other stuff, stuff that we can't talk about. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> but but it'll be cool. It's going to be cool. Yep. It's going to be very cool. Uh, we got a lot of a lot of cool stuff planned, uh, and especially especially uh, for Microsoft fans. You know, they're going to be doing all kinds of fun stuff with us. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, yeah please uh, check it out, and we hope that you guys enjoy it. What you see at Gamescom, yeah. right? And at the same time, we're actually, you know, in the preparation for you know the following event, oh, yeah, including TG. Oh, oh, man, oh, man, yeah. we'll all be oh, there, goals. yeah, that's right. We got other stuff planned, and uh, I think we'll hear a lot more about that right. either at or after Gamescom, right? Mm-hmm. Right, we got a lot of cool stuff. Well, actually, we have it has been announced that we're going to PAX, right? Mm-hmm. It has been announced that we're yep. going to PAX, that's out there, so right. yep. Uh, me and Okada San, you know, go to PAX for DMC, yeah. Yeah. and that. That dude, Capcom USA has got some amazing stuff yeah, planned. Yeah, for that, so. that, that's going to be really cool. Oh, and dude. producer H. That's right. Uh, so Amber Toon and uh, you know, Michi uh, going to attend uh, Brazil. Brazil. That's right. That was yeah. Really yeah. Cool. That's right. Yeah. Which, yeah. which is pretty cool. Like, we're all over the world, actually. Dude, right? that, that's so cool. And it actually, what's really cool is most of the people on here are from all over the world, too. I know. Right? I a, lot that. Of, a lot I of the that. people that are supporting us are from everywhere. So that's pretty I cool. I love it, man. We're yeah. metropolitan, baby. Uh, they'll be uh, like PAX Australia, right? There, there is a back there is, there, yeah, yeah. yeah. We're cool. not sure that we'll, you know, we'll have a Yeah, we're not sure if we're going to be there. We'd, but, we'd, we'd love to. Yeah, that would be yeah, cool. We would love to. Yeah. We would love really to cool. do that. Uh, Australia is awesome. That would be fantastic, you know. Yeah, but yeah, whether whether or not we can actually get our ducks in a row and actually get out there, mm-hmm. I think we're, uh, we'll are we have to keep, you know, banging on that and see how it goes. But that'd be mm-hmm. sweet. Oh, yeah. dude, that'd be so yeah, cool. Right? Australia, man, that's it's it's also close enough to Japan. I mean, it's far away, but, you know, it's closer. Yeah, it's far about the same time. At least, yeah, the time it's like two, one or two hours. One, or different, yeah. maybe, right. yeah. Right, yeah, yeah, it'd be sweet. All right, cool. So is there anything else that we want to talk, that we can talk about for RE2 at this point or no? <laughs> <laughs> Probably not. Probably, I mean, we've I had... I want to spoil oh, exactly. So that's kind of... Thanks actually, for letting us know where you are. I'll, I'll take a look at these later. Everyone's starting to drop where oh, they're sweet. from. Oh, sweet, where they're from. That's awesome. Other, like, Anybody from Detroit in there? Slovenia, um, California. Ooh. Yeah. Um, Mexico. Bingo, yes. No, we should go. We're going to go to England. We got to go to England at some point. So Texas. Saying, do something in Texas, Florida, Florida Indiana, Las Vegas. Damn, Ooh, now it's just Scotland, going crazy. Iran, Chile, yeah, Chile. Norway, Italy. Philippines. This is awesome. Yeah. Matt, they want to. Cheer up. Cheer up, crew cut. Wow. New York City. Yes. Nice. Cheer up, crew cut. <laughs> Brazil, awesome. Ecuador. This is crazy. Venezuela, oh, Poland. Man, nice. Nice. Vegas. Ah, sweet. Wow. Yeah, this is awesome. 
Swing to Nashville. Ireland. Oh, nice. Dante for Smash. They wanted me to say Dante for Smash. Dude, oh, don't say that. I'm because not gonna, we, no, no. <laughs> Wouldn't that be cool, though? <laughs> Dude, I don't know, I don't know how, how we could possibly make that happen, but oh, that'd be so cool. Well, actually, somebody wrote that they wanted to see you in Smash Brothers. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, hey, man. If Sakurai is down with it, man, like, whatever, but... <laughs> Sweet that dude. I, I wish I wish there was some way we could reach out to them, those people. But I, I'm already I've already said too much, haven't I? Okay. Yes. Well, do, do not lead people on. <laughs> no, there's no no leading people on. You're being serious. You wish there was something you did, right? Mm, of course. Yes. yes okay. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's exactly what I'm saying. Why? Did I say? I don't know. I don't want people to get confused. All right. Well, yes. I wish there was something. Trust me. Trust Matt me. Matt Walker for Smash. See, that's what I'm talking about. Montreal. <laughs> Um, Wish, right? <laughs> cool. Is there anything else you guys want to talk about before uh, we end the discussion about Gamescom? I mean, it's coming up soon, so. Right. You guys are pretty much ready. I'm still, I'm still putting the finishing touches on things. I need to make sure everything's done. I'm still almost, not done. Almost. Yeah. <laughs> almost. Yeah. yeah. I yeah. haven't got the. The schedule. schedule. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I need to put the schedule. I have to. I have to get the schedule together. Yes, I'm. I'm, I'm going to do that today. That's one of the things. Right, I'm gonna yeah, do today. Yeah, yeah. yeah, we are ready to go. We're also going to have to cut this. No, we won't cut. I'll this. do that. No, I mean, sorry. Split like put it into oh, mean, podcast edit, format. Ah, edit yeah. the podcast. Yeah, yeah. True enough. I cool. will bring a, a director. Yeah, yeah. Sure. yeah that's really right. cool. Cut on. Cut on. Oh yeah, one of the directors, yeah, right? Nice. Yes. Sweet. Yeah, that's cool. Yes. Yeah, it's. Too bad we couldn't have him on, because right. um, uh, but but well, well, you'll get to see him soon. Actually, I got mm. the Devil May Cry floor on purpose. So. <laughs> you guys, you guys can have your Resident Evil one sometime. Mm-hmm. Right now, it's Devil May Cry. Well, actually, First it's, it's both. Game. It's both. That's both. Whatever. Yeah. See, I have no allegiance. I like both. <laughs> <laughs> Devil May Cry is back. All right, so. <laughs> I retreat back. I retreat right. back. <laughs> we're going to do that on Capcom TV. We do it, man. We gonna, do it. We, I think, we, all right, guys, do wrestle. Go. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Uh, do, do we need to move on to talk to uh, Maki? Is that going to happen? So I mean, I think we going to grab memoirs? her before she goes to lunch. Yeah, if we're going to do Maki's memoirs, we better. Oh, miss. Resident Evil 2 hype. There we go. Yeah, all right. Capcom yeah. Civil War might happen. Who's going to win? Peter Matt. It's going to be Matt. It's going to be Matt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, McCry is just better. That's all. I mean, you know, that's really all, all we can say. What's, uh, hold on. I have to find Maki on the, uh, the dealie here. Will we ever get Ruben, Dan, or JYB on the podcast? Mm, who knows? That'd be cool. Maybe. That'd be cool. That's another thing where I wish we could do that. And so, you know, yeah. we, have to, we have to see what we can do. Dante in Resident Evil 2 Remake. Mm, that mm. would be interesting. Uh, what, are you, what are your favorite Dante outfits? Do you have a favorite Dante outfit? Mm, so, maybe three. That makes sense. Oh, I was talking about that the other day, the rhinestones, yeah. man. Yeah. The rhinestones are pretty badass. Oh, the rhinestone yep. cowboy. Yep, yep, yep. My favorite, I mean, I'm I'm kind of biased, but we've seen Dante in the trailers for DMC5, right? Mm. So, I think that is... Nah, cool. it's cool. Like, I know, I cool. know there are people on the internet that are like, he looks older or whatever, like, but... I love that Dante. Yeah. I think no, me so too. Cool. I, think I think he's, he's fucking so awesome. Cool. Yeah. He's oh, so cool. sorry, I cursed. That's okay. <laughs> yeah. That's okay. I think it's okay. Is Maki gonna? Is Maki gonna one join beauty, us? One beauty, one beauty. She's she's asking which building we're in. Oh God! <laughs> <laughs> no, don't get lost. The same building you're in. Uh, you, she could walk. Foxy Grandpa. What does that mean? Dante. Oh, Dante. Dante. Foxy Grandpa. Right. Okay. All right. Dante is heckin' awesome. Oh, there we go. Yeah, man. I'll, instead of like F, that. I'll say heckin'. Announce, don't, what? Do you, no hearts broken, Peter. Ooh, all right. What's your favorite what, Devil May Cry weapon? What, is, what does that mean? Weapon. Yeah. Weapon. But basically, I like the regular one, Ebony and Agony. Right on. Yep, yeah. yep. The standard weapons yeah. are always good. All right, but, but if we're talking about that, then is it, do we like uh, Sparta? Sparta or... Maki and Sporta or the uh, I'm blanking right now I can't believe I'm blanking on the most important <laughs> Rebellion, <sword. laughs> Rebellion. <laughs> yeah. uh, maybe Rebellion yeah. Yeah. yeah it's it's an awesome design man yeah. it's timeless it's timeless thanks. you know yeah baby I just said thanks to a oh, comment oh Pandora yeah it's Pandora tree. nice oh. <laughs> nice a lot of people can man alright we got all kinds of oh, Yamato for the win is one of the uh, <laughs> one of the comments People do love people do love Yamato, man. People love Virgil. I still think my favorite character is Van Coon. Van Coon, Van Coon is an excellent character, isn't he? That's true. Isn't Van, he? Yeah. Is it a he or is it a she? Well, I don't know. We don't know. Hey, it's a van. It's a van. You know. <laughs> it's you know like 
Vancouver's pretty awesome. And and yeah, and so we we met the people that you know made the van. You know, we met yep. Nick yep. We met Kino Sasan. We met Alex and Wilson. Well, I wonder if Wilson's off, off today. I haven't seen him yet today. I didn't see Wilson either. He would have been sitting right over there. I don't yeah, know. we could have brought him on. Yeah, yeah. Now we're just killing time waiting for Maki. Is Maki coming? <laughs> I, she said she's coming. It's, okay, it's, we it's don't want to let people. The elevator is pretty crowded. Uh, yeah. yeah, it's uh, bad timing. Uh, Stops like every four. So. If she, yeah, that's right. Yeah, because so yeah, a little inside info. It's lunchtime here in Japan. <laughs> inside info, yes. Yeah. Inside info. Lunchtime. You wouldn't have been able to figure that out if you used that's the right. internet. And uh, oh, ah, here she comes. Here she is. Oh, she's okay. Monster Hunter shirt. Look at this. Nice. Oh. Oh, she's right. bringing the log. Yeah, come on, sister. Come on in. All right. Why don't you sit right here? Okay. In the middle. Uh, yeah, you guys, you guys sit down. I'll, I'll sit over on the side over here. Maybe perhaps you can sit here or something. All right. So uh, here she is. There's Monty, Monty the, the one and only. Here she is. Where's the camera? The camera's right there. Okay. <laughs> All right. Nice. How you doing? Oh, wow. Look at this. You're getting a big, cute, cute Maki. <laughs> cute Maki. <laughs> Thank you. Hello, Maki. Wow. Ooh, you get a like, waifu up here. Oh, wow. Waifu. You got a lot of fans, Maki. <laughs> um, so if you've, listen, if you've listened to it, uh, the podcast Thank before, you. you'll know this segment and how it works. Uh, basically, what we're going to do is we're going to read an excerpt from Maki's memoir, which is her journal that she puts together for us every day. So why don't you uh, do the honors and turn us to the page. Okay. Well, well first of all, why don't you yeah. say hi to everybody? Yeah. Oh, hi, everyone. I'm Maki. Thank you for listening. Yeah. <laughs> and listening and watching. But yeah. listening is good because this will be a podcast. Oh, yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah. Um, I, I saw the comment um, about Maki's memoir. Like one comment, and then Pete sent me a link, and I'm really really happy to yeah that was all her idea (laughs) she didn't know that she was going to be the one writing the memoir though (laughs) (laughs) it backfired me that was great it was for the best yeah nice did you get a new haircut (laughs) yes I did nice Nice. Nice. my pants are a little shorter (laughs) and it's straighter yeah yeah yeah. like it did you get a perm yeah straight permed Yeah. I should do that one of these days. I should try that out. Yeah. No, Matt, you're beautiful the way you are. Oh, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> That's nice of you. <laughs> All right. So we're going to do this? We're gonna do yeah, that let's do it. So, okay. disclaimer, please stop. Oh, yeah, that's right. I have to start with the disclaimer. Yeah. This diary contains Maki's raw thoughts, and due to English being the writer's second language and the nature of the content, this diary may contain content which can be considered not appropriate to broadcast on this podcast. <laughs> Read at your own discretion. That's a message for you. Know, us. You guys don't realize it because you can't see, but that's literally the face he makes every single time he reads that. So, <laughs> he literally it's a very like serious. Uh, yeah. 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 That's true. I do that. That's, yeah. That's what yeah. I'm saying. I go into the. Uh, Matt Walker is back. Yeah. Was did, a- did Matt Walker go anywhere? That's okay. I like it. Wow. <laughs> okay. Let's, um, let's move on. So. <laughs> Where are we starting? Okay, we're starting on Wednesday, August 1st. Oh, what a sad day. My fear since the reorg in last April came true today. Oh, God. Today was the day we had to say goodbye to the seventh floor and move to the eighth floor. Not sure if I'll be able to continue my memoirs anymore, being separated from those amazingly funny people. I don't think I'll have much to write. The eighth floor is kind of dark with not much natural light coming in. Blinds are shut on most of the windows. (laughs) I miss sunlight and eavesdropping on conversations that make me giggle. That's all right. Okay, Matt, you want to take this next one? All right. We've moved on to the fifth. All right, here we go. Why don't you you kind of- Should I get in there? Should I? Uh, All right, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm making my senior producer move move (laughs) over. This does not bode well. All right. Sunday, August 5th, 2018. Watched a French movie at home. Googled the English title. It's called The Day I Saw Your Heart. In the movie, a guy said, Starbucks coffee is not real coffee, and took the main character out to a cafe for real coffee. In the cafe, they were having Illy coffee, which is the same coffee Luca usually drinks at work. Who's Luca? Luca is one of our amazing Italian localizers on the Loke team, and he does drink Illy coffee because he's he's Italian. Italian. (laughs) I can dig. It seems like a lot of guys here, the Loke informal global production guys, are into coffee. 
To me, it seems like being into coffee is American and a European thing. I don't think Japanese people are that into coffee. Really? I, I disagree. Really? Yeah, there's magazines based on coffee. There's like the whole third wave discussion. Really? Really? Yeah. Well, you guys are Japanese. See? Do you like yeah. coffee? Yeah, yes. I like coffee yes. at all. Yeah. All right. Well, we know they at least like coffee. Whether they're into <laughs> coffee, that's, so, that's just good. There are people yeah. who are quite into coffee here. Right on. Me being Japanese, I can't really tell the difference between coffee made with different beans or different roasts. Understandable. Hmm. I'm not super into Starbucks, but pumpkin spice latte that they bring back every year around Halloween is an exception. Starbucks is big in Japan, so yep. asked. I wonder if I can get it in Japan as well. I like that. That's a, that's a very interesting question. Yeah, they don't I, usually I have it. No. Really, they don't? No. I feel like they do some do some kind of like... The pumpkin you know, spice one, did they? I think I, it, I they, last year started the pumpkin, pumpkin spice trend in Japan, but I didn't mm, see the coffee. Right. Maybe they did have maybe it. Maybe this year. Maybe this year would be... Maybe this year. Maybe, maybe this year's the year. Pumpkin spice. Yeah. Okay. Right on. Are we gonna do? Are we gonna keep going? Yeah, let's. Uh, should we have one of them read the next right. one? Count how about it, man? The tradition is that the guest has to read. <laughs> <laughs> Troy, oh, this, this is uh, August sixth, two thousand eighteen. All right. Uh, Troy got an electric kettle at the shitty mall. Ah, the shitty mall. Uh, For us to use on the eighth floor. <laughs> so that's the, that's an inside joke. See, we have a mall here called the City Mall, but in Japanese, Japanese, you say shitty mall. This is how it's spelled. Mm. <laughs> shitty yeah. mall. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. S-H-I-T-I. That's like all of our nicknames. We, we have, yeah, okay, we'll get into that one. <laughs> so you, U you you. and I yeah. uh, chipped in. You is a person. <laughs> He got a uh, 0 0.8 liter kettle with a uh, salmon pink body and a white lid. Right on. Very cute. Mm -hmm. I approve. Excellent. <laughs> Excellent. Excellent. We decided to give it a name, so uh, I came up with uh, uh, quite a bit of ideas, but uh, almost all of them were rejected. Aww. For the record, here are some, uh, uh, some of the ideas I brought up. This is what I wanted. Sushi. Sushi. Okay, for the kettle. Okay. Sushi. Uh, Wild you put sushi cat? in the kettle? Well, there's probably it's a reason. the color combination. Oh, oh I see. Yeah. Oh, 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 Looks like sushi. See, that's a step up. Right. Wildcat. Uh, sush. It's short for sushi. <laughs> sush. Oh, short for sushi. Okay. Big cat. Su. Because it's made by tiger. Right, I'm uh, yeah, yeah. The manufacturer. Right, uh, uh, okay. I guess that's well the same with the wildcat. So, so far, uh, we have variations on two themes. So I far. see, I see. Chats, cat, chubbers. <laughs> chubbers. <laughs> chubbers. Right on, uh, chubbers. That's like, okay. That's a round kettle, so like, it's chubbers. Okay. Yeah, I can do that. Okay. I kind of like the sushi because the, the color combination uh, remind, rem reminded me of the salmon and nigiri, or sushi for short. Uh, took a while for us to uh, agree on the name, and the one we all approved was uh, Nana. Came from the word Nanashi. Nanashi. Which means uh, no name in ah. Japanese. Nanashi. Ah. Nanashi. Happy that we have a cute uh, pink kettle. Mm. Added later, <laughs> my sister pointed out that uh, naming a kettle is kind of weird. <laughs> and that doesn't happen at her workplace. <laughs> I guess most uh, workplace is like my sister's. I'm glad to be around people who don't think naming their stuff is strange. <laughs> <laughs> well, yes. I mean, it's okay. important. You need, to, you need to have a name for your stuff. So, that, <laughs> yeah. so, you, know, so you know what to put on the name tag. You know? That's right. Very good diary, yeah. 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 Do, you, do, you, do you want to read the next yeah. one? Uh, should I, should I yeah, it's pretty long. <laughs> yeah, I'll go over here. August 10th? Okay. Uh, sorry, I'm not really good at reading. Uh, but went to a Spanish restaurant for dinner with my sister after work. We ordered too much food. I can read. She? Ah, portions were mm -hmm. bigger than we thought. And she stopped eating when 20% of the food was still on the plate. So I had to finish it all. Couldn't let the good food go to waste. Amen to that. Oh. I know. Oh. I would eat it. Dude, I would eat it too. <laughs> if it was good. 
It I was super good. It. <laughs> I knew it. As long as it didn't have mushrooms, I'd probably do it. It's so Sorry, wrong. It's, Ken, <laughs> it's the longest one. Yeah. Yeah. Switch out. We, we can switch. We can yeah. switch. Yeah. Whatever you yeah. want to do. Okay. Switch. All right. Ready? Yeah. You want to do? All right. Sure. Yeah. We'll go in order. Um, the area where we were sitting had a huge head of a black bull hung on the wall, staring right at us. Incidentally, we ordered a dish with beef. Hmm. Wonder if it didn't come to the mind of whomever decided to put the bullhead on the wall that it might make customers feel eating beef feel uncomfortable. It didn't. I totally forgot about it by the time we finished the beef dish. Thank God. So not uncomfortable with a bull's head hanging well, while you're watching you eat the beef. I, yeah. I wasn't facing the bull. I see. So uh, that's why. But that's people why. who are like clo- sitting closer to the bullhead, right. I or think watching. that would be kind of uncomfortable because mm-hmm. you're eating. You're eating it. You're eating the bull. <laughs> that's right. That's a good point. It's a very good point. And the thing is already dead. <laughs> Yeah, uh, hope, hopefully it's not alive hanging on the wall. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen movies where that's happened. Yeah. 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 Uh, right now. We each ordered a glass of wine. Got pretty tipsy, and we're feeling very good. I was talking about the bike I've been enjoying. I- eyeing, sorry, eyeing. Showing her photos of the bike on an online bike shop. And she said, that's a cute bike. Uh, you should call the bike store and see if they have the model in stock. They have a physical retail store in Tokyo. I made a call and it turned out they only have one left. I told her it was the last one and she said, look, you've been looking for a bike and haven't had any luck, but now you found this one and it's the last one in the store. Maki, that bike is meant to be yours. That's true. Which is the excuse she uses for herself whenever she wants to buy something, but cannot quite justify the purchase with her logical mind. Push the button, do it. And I hit the button and purchased the bike. Oh man, it's like live under the influence of alcohol and my sister's not so logical persuasion. (laughs) Putting aside a tiny problem that I haven't, that I have trouble turning on a bike. Yes, this is a very key point. I'm very happy I pushed the button. So Maki doesn't actually know how to turn on a bike. Oh, so she can only ride straight. Straight. Oh, okay. She can't actually turn. She'll fall off. So this is. And this is why I'm really looking for you. Now that you have the bike, I'm really excited about this because then we can, now we can live stream <laughs> practicing on the bike. It'll be good. We can, I, I look forward to seeing what it's going to be like to turn. Well, are you going to teach me how to Sure. Turn? Yeah, of course. Of course. Someone said that you pulled your buying trigger. Pulled the bar ah, like a double trigger, yes, but, it's a buying but trigger. it's a buying trigger. Bang, bang, bang. Pull yes. that purchase trigger. Bike stream win. So <laughs> maybe right. we'll stream Maki riding a bike. <laughs> I like this. That's a good idea. Thanks. Thanks, li- viewer. And she'll, she'll, be, she'll be pulling the uh, the brake trigger a lot, too. Exactly. There you go. Yeah. I like it. Yeah. We doing another one? Yeah. There's the last one, I think. Oh, sweet. All right. Think, is it the last one? I oh. think so. All right. Let's yep, do the last one. one. All right. Sunday, August 12th, 2018. I like reading what people's t-shirts say, but this mm-hmm. one I saw today when I was walking to the station was an eye catcher. Wow. I don't know if I can say this, Pete. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> can I say that? Why not? I All already right. cursed. All right, fair enough. So Curse incoming. The, the, the eye-catching uh. shirt. It said, motherfucker, all in capital and bold font. Uh. It was a nice, peaceful Sunday morning in a family-friendly area, and suddenly a guy in this T-shirt comes up running towards my direction. It seemed very out of place. I wonder if you knew what the word on his T-shirt means. It's a good question. We do get that a lot, right? We get a lot of, like... You know, yep. weird English on T-shirts in Japan, mm-hmm. and in vice versa. In, in the U.S., you get a lot of oh yeah, you get like, like, weird, like Japanese yeah, weird or tattoos and stuff. <laughs> tattoos yeah. that makes no sense right. at all. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah and just think, some, like thanks to this this broadcast, now someone's going to get a tattoo of Maki on their arm at some point. I know. Hopefully, they get the right kanji. But <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> you have kanji for your name? I do. You know, I didn't realize that. I do. You've never seen them. I've never seen it. No. <laughs> Huh. It's in my actually, email. Actually, I probably have seen it. You're right. All right, fair enough. So, <laughs> all right, and I think with that, we're gonna say uh, what? Say big Dante, guys. They want big you Dante? to say big Dante. Say big Dante, guys. Like that. Matt looks stoned. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there were, there were comments like that for the for the E3. Yeah, you, you <laughs> did. That was too. that was weird. I'm not stoned. No, so, right. we normally look like this. Here. I just I I, I do get really squinty eyed though, right? Is it really? I think I get squinty-eyed. Well, there are bright lights in your That's face. Part of it, I guess, yeah. but, all right, yeah, we're rambling. So, 
Yes. Are we gonna are we gonna call it a day? Yeah. Let's uh, let's uh, say where they can find us. All right. Well, on Twitter, anyways. Mm-hmm. Yep. Everybody can find us on our Twitter account, Dev One Underscore Official. Ooh, you said it right. Damn. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> that was that wasn't on purpose. <laughs> on Twitter, right? And on iTunes and stuff. We yep. You can find us on most places where you can find what, where you download podcasts. Yep. Um, and of course, you're, if anyone wants to give out their personal Twitter account, if they even have one, I don't have one. You don't have yeah, one. Don't no, no. Have, no. Well, it's yeah. just you and me, Matt. Yeah, Go ahead, Matt. Where, right. where can they find you? On Twitter, I'm Gypsy Otoko. Yes, and I am P <laughs> Fabiano. Um, they're asking if we're sleeping well. No, nah, not really. Well, I'm, I'm some great. Thank you. <laughs> like seriously, like I've had I've been really busy over the last couple of weeks, and so like just over the last week, I've been able to sleep more because I haven't been as well. I've been busy, but I've still found a way to go home. A C- couple of last questions, though. Some some people are asking: Are there any more music video hints that they can find? Oh man! So my understanding is that in the Devil Trigger video, there's still something people haven't found. Or if they've found it, they haven't decoded it yet. So I guess we'll see. We'll see how that goes. Well, I guess maybe you'll have to give them hints eventually. Yeah, eventually. eventually. Uh, so hopefully you guys have enjoyed this uh, experiment yeah. of ours, and we'll see how it goes. Um, give us your feedback on the Twitter account. Um, I'm I'm looking at the comments right now, and it's or the chat comments right now, and it's been it's been nice. Yeah. You guys have been really really great. Yeah, thanks a lot, um, guys. And for those who are listening to this as a podcast, thanks again for listening. Thank and, you very much uh, for your we'll time. We'll see you soon. Yeah, so guys, want to take us out? Thank you. All right. All right, and see you at Gamescom. Gamescom. Yeah. Uh, I won't. Gamescom. <laughs> All right. Now we have to turn it off. <laughs> Yes. Bye, guys. Take it easy. Matt Walker for president. Oh, you guys are too nice. I love you all. See you guys. Keep on trucking. Pull my devil trigger.